<laughs> Good sit. Have a, you want to know what I got? What do I have? It's just a hug. Oh, I love you. <laughs> so it's safe to say that she, this is Pepper. She's not um, the greatest at listening because she's very stubborn. So I think a good idea is we are going to train this puppy to be a show dog or just to listen better. Either one. I would be happy with either one. So. All right. So we're going to go through the basics first since she struggles with those already. All right. So that's a good sit. Can you lay down? Pepper down. No. <laughs> Pepper down. Good girl. Good down. Can you sit? Can you sit back up? No. Can you roll over? No. Can you roll over? Pepper, roll over. Roll over. No. Pepper, roll over. Roll over. You ready? Ready? Roll over. Roll over. Oh. Good girl. That was almost it. Pepper, can you give me paw? No. 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 Can you give me paw? Can you paw? That's a good girl. Good girl. Good paw. One trick that my other dogs know how to do is sit pretty. But this one does not. And the other two just kind of learned it on their own. Like, I don't really know where they picked it up. To be fair, my two older dogs, they went to, like, doggy training camp or dog school or whatever you call it. <laughs> when I first got this one, yes. Oh, good paw. When we first got her, I put her in that same, like, doggy school training thing. Well, then I got really busy, so I stopped taking her. She missed, like, the last two classes, and I didn't... <laughs> hey, hold on, Greedy. She missed the last two classes, and I didn't want to... I didn't have time to make them up, so she's a doggy dropout. You didn't get your diploma. Okay, you want to learn how to sit pretty? Okay, we're going to try. Ready? Pepper, can you sit pretty? Pepper, sit pretty? Okay, wait, no, 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 that's, that's a good lay down, but that's not what I'm looking for. My hands are getting really clammy with these Cheerios, and they're going to be so sticky. And no, we don't have dog treats, so I use Cheerios. The vet said that Cheerios were okay, so don't come for my head if they're not. They're fine. Pepper, can you sit? Pepper, sit. Get up. We're going to sit pretty. Sit pretty. Sit pretty. Sit pretty. Almost. Sit pretty. Here, baby. Give me both your paws. Sit pretty. <gasps> My other dog, she she can still sit pretty, but she, like, needs your help. So, like, if you put your arm out, she'll, like, grab onto it. This one just can't do it at all. <laughs> She's having issues. It's okay. All right. We're going to try it again. Ready? Sit pretty. Sit pretty. Wait. Sit pretty. Good girl. Should I go get a bell and like Pavlov train her? She knows her basics and that's really all I could ask for. Ideally, I would like her to listen more. Oh, I don't have anything, but I don't, I'm not a professional like dog trainer, so I just, I, I don't have the patience for it. Do you want to go to the pet store? Do you want to go get a new toy? <gasps> a while ago, I took her to the, the pet store and I like let her pick out a toy and she picked out this little like gecko chameleon thing and she loved it. Like she was obsessed with it. Um, but then she ripped it up. So we had to throw it away. You want to go get a new toy? Okay, we are on our way to PetSmart. I don't know if I'm going to film in there just because, I don't know, it's like a little, a little awkward, a little, mm. but she's going to go pick out a toy all by herself, and don't worry, I have her buckled up. Yeah. Pepper, are you 
you excited? She thinks we're going to the VET, so I think she's a little scared. Pepper! Hey, baby. She's so mad at me. Look at this sass. I'm just gonna go get you a toy. That's all we're doing. Pepper! We're just going to get you a toy, okay? Get a new toy. Is that scary? I was gonna get her that same little chameleon toy that she had before. I know. But I was like, well that's I don't know, I just didn't want to get the same old toy. So I found the bin that's like the clearance toys, because mama's on a budget. And mama's sweating up a storm. Anyway, so you can hear her panting, I'm sorry. Um so I'm on a budget, like a $2 budget. So I decided to get like two clearance toys for less than what that one toy would have cost. So I was like, okay, like, and plus if I get to two, like, yes, they're a little bit cheaper and not as nice, but then I can give it to my, um, my older dog. Hold on. Someone's calling me. Okay. Okay. Bye. As I was saying before I was rudely interrupted was that I got two toys that way my older dog will not be mad at me for not getting her anything because I did that the last time and I felt really bad so this time I got two toys I'll show you let's do a little mini haul if you will <laughs> so I, I just thought this was really funny so I wanted to get it here little got a little hot dog got a little hot dog like your hot dog? I hope she likes these. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Okay, you're gonna play with it at home? Sounds good. And I also got... I also got an avocado for her because I just thought it was really funny and cute. So these are more so for me. Just kidding, but not really. You okay? Get the avocado. An avocado. Thanks. That was literally just her reaction. She's like, okay. She's making me nervous. I think we might run through Starbucks and get her a little puppuccino. I'm a true YouTuber. Oh my gosh, I should move to LA, huh? Yeah. Are you excited? Did you get lots of good toys? That's the face of a happy pup. All right, here's the little puppuccino. Let me unbuckle you. I know. Is it too hot for you? Here, I'll turn on the air. Come here. Look what I got. Hey, baby, look what I got for you. Oh my gosh, you already have it on your nose. Is that good? Are these little... The little like whipped cream for dogs. Is it called a puppuccino or am I like, cause I said a puppuccino and he was like, oh yeah, the, the puppy whip, like, like did I just make up something or is it a puppuccino? Cause, or did I just sound like an idiot? <laughs> an idiot. Do you like it? Oh my gosh, she has some on her chin. Oh my gosh, that's too funny. Okay, I think that's enough for now, huh? Why don't we space it out? That's a lot of sugar for you. <laughs> Why do you sound so gross when you eat? Oh my gosh. Her nose is like so, her face is so chunky and right there, so like she can't reach the rest of it. But she's gotten a good amount, so I think I'll just take it home and like scoop it out on a spoon for her or something. Is that good? How would you rate it? On a scale of one to 10, what would you rate it? A seven. Should I do a taste test review of the thing that I always get?
I'm telling you, like there's certain Starbucks that just get it right every single time. And I will drive the extra like five minutes to this one just because they make this so good. Like it just, it hits the spot every single time. Oh my gosh, so good. Okay, well, when we get home, we'll do a little haul and a review of her toys. Cut. Pepper pouts, even though I just did that entire day for her, but no. What a little brat. Okay, I don't know if I'd call this a successful day, but I sure would not call it an unsuccessful day. So, so it is what it is. Don't rip up the avocado, it's my favorite. Subscribe! Should I do a true YouTuber outro? Make sure to like this video, please follow me on absolutely everything and turn on post notifications, that way you get a little ding and anytime I post and blah, 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 blah. <laughs> okay, I don't even know if I'm in frame, but I totally forgot to showcase Pepper's greatest talent. Isn't that right? He wants a squeaky avocado. Do you see how high she jumps? That one wasn't as good. The first one, she's a little mean, green, jumping machine. <laughs> uh -huh, you lost your toy. <laughs> She was getting close. She's like finding the squeaker in it. Ew, this is disgusting. Okay. Is it? All right, you can just have a drink. I can't do this. Uh-uh, hey, hey, ah! Oh my gosh, Pepper. Crazy.